Hi to viewers and my dear subscribers. In this video, I am going to tell about the question which we have asked by the the student. As you can see there, the first program we have asked is four bit adder in data flow model. So in my previous video, I have told you how to implement it. If not, you can see it in the description or a I button is present there. You can see there. And now we will be seeing how we have I have implemented it. You can go through the program by pausing it and just maximize your window as much as possible, and you can able to see the program. If you insist, then I will be putting in my blog. If you insist, then only. Uh, my dear Coffee by Charlie, if you insist, then only I will put in the blog else you can go ahead, go ahead by this so see uh, what i have done here is i have taken a full adder and what the i have implemented the basic data flow of this full adders and they have, have connected them as i have mentioned in the diagram w2 w3 w4 are the wires intermediate wires which i have declared and then as it is i have pasted it as you can see you can go through the program you can compare these both and you can see these both the diagrams i can you can maximize it and you can able to see so uh, let us minimize and then let us make full code to be visible so module it will be starting and this is the end module okay so pause it and watch it see the code so nothing to explain about the code you can go through it same i have implemented you can check it by simulating it so here is my simulation i am giving all the ones which is the maximum out this is the maximum thing we get and we get as zero all ones so that is the thing zero all ones and here also one we get a carry also one let us use small small inputs and let us see what the output is now let us change the radix of the because we most of us we don't know the binary so let us change the radix and let us see oh it is 12 and we got the answer as a 6 oh there we go we have a carry as 1 now. so okay let us see by taking another value for it for this so let us give a value and like post constant let me give a decimal value so let me give a 3 and let me give a 5 so it is quite small number so it will be fitted yeah we got it here we go the carry is also 0 and we got the value also perfect value okay thank you for watching this video if you have any doubts regarding this you can comment below and you can ask anytime if you have any videos like you want it then i will be putting it thank you for watching this video